Uh, so today we're going to discuss the admin print styles. Uh, in my previous video we have discussed the admin print scripts and it's very similar to that except that uh, it allows you to include your inline uh, style into the admin section uh, head of the head. Okay, so let's check. So I see that uh, admin print style basically uh, on the codex page we don't have much information about it but uh, I figured it out what it means. So basically uh, it is mainly used to echo the inline style in the admin pages header. So if you go to the admin page header uh, you know you can include the inline style into the head section of the uh, admin page okay so like this is included this is the inline style similarly you can include yours as well okay cool so let's put that in action before we do that uh, let's check as to you know where is it defined this hook is defined so let's click on the WordPress code reference and um, admin print styles Let's copy that and paste it here. <clears throat> so it says that it fires when the styles are printed for all admin pages. Okay, so this hook gets fired when all the styles of the admin page get fire, uh, are printed. Okay, so where is it included? Um, so if you go to adambrown.info, it is and search it. You can see that it's included in the class WP customize widget.php like the previous one uh, so you can see that this is the file and this is the definition of this do action with this hook name in the print styles function okay so we can attach our custom function uh, to this particular hook so that's what I've done over here so I'm using add action um, latching onto this hook uh, using my custom function and uh, I'm including my inline style okay and let's go ahead and save this let's refresh the page and as you can see that the style has been applied even if you look at the page source refresh the page you can see that the style body background this which is the same as what we have here has been applied okay so just to recap um, admin print style hook allows us to uh, include our inline style into the head section header section of the uh, admin dashboard page okay so that's about it and you can continue to watch the next video thank you